Buddhist question that I find really interesting is, is there a way to enjoy all the things of this world and to be connected and to love, but not be attached? Do you think that's possible? Yes, I, I believe that there are many moments in people's lives, as well as mine, that have experienced leaving something, a person, that you truly do care about. And it's that separation that makes it so unbelievably hard to try and experience. I realized that nothing ever will stay the same, that everything's built on changes. And there's always constant change happening in your life that you can't avoid and it's something that you can't save yourself from. Nothing is here forever and we just have to learn to let go and love the time that we have on earth or love the things or animals or other people that we have and the, to really like respect the time that we have with them. Nothing is permanent. Every moment that you've been around and um, every grain of sand is important. It feels very good once you finish it. So when we had to take away the sand mandala and have to pour it out, we show that those moments still stay in our lives because the sand will still be there and it can still be something that you can remember. When we were sweeping it up from the table and we were putting it into the bowls and everybody was walking down to the creek and we were pouring them out into the creek. The sand mandala symbolizes that nothing is permanent because it's hard to let things go. Like it's hard if you have to move away from your friends or family, and, but you can get through it because nothing is permanent in that, I mean, impermanence is a beautiful thing.